Hey, what's going on, guys? Thanks for coming back for another episode. Today, we are going to talk about backlapping. Stay tuned. Alright guys, so, autofocus being crazy. Hey, so what is backlapping? Um, backlapping is the way you sharpen the blade on a real mower. And basically, what you need to backlap is some backlapping compound. I got this stuff, it's backwards, but uh, I got it from off of Amazon. Basically, it's, uh, it's made by pin high um, and basically what backlapping compound is is it's uh, like liquid sandpaper so what you do uh, is you put this liquid sandpaper or this backlapping compound directly onto the reel spin the reel in reverse and that backlapping compound on the reel comes in contact with the bed knife and through that process sharpens the blade and so we're doing it today on the John Deere 180B um, reel mower and uh, basically all you need to do it on this particular mower is a drill a one inch socket opens, opens, opens. one inch socket back lapping compound and uh, that's pretty much it it's a pretty simple process um, so what you do is you take this cap off over here on this side there's a cap that covers up the axle for the John Deere here I'll take you over Let's see if you can see it so this this cap right here pull this cap off and inside there you'll see there's this bolt right here, it's pretty hard to see. There's this bolt right here that you put your one inch socket on and uh, then you spin it in reverse. That's really the whole process. It's pretty simple. Um, I've never done it before, but we'll see how much it really affects it. So right now I'm getting a lot of stragglers when I'm mowing the lawn. So we'll see uh, how much this affects it. So next thing you're gonna see is sharpening the blade. So you take the Backlapping compound is basically liquid sandpaper. So what it's going to do is help you make those edges sharp again. Oh, 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 oh,
done a little bit of the back flapping compound on there now. Now I'm going to uh, loosen up these adjustments real quick and then tighten it a click or two uh, up against the bed knife. See if we can get it a little bit sharper. So here we go. So I wanted to show everybody just how much better let's see if I'll focus those blades look. It's hard to tell. Let's see if we can get you in here. If you look, blades in here on the uh, Toro. Pretty similar to how the John Deere look. They're getting dull, not super bright and shiny. Um, this cleaned up those edges really well, so I'm very interested to see how much better the cut quality is. Alright guys, so we have backlapped the reel, um, and now basically all we need to do is clean it off before we take it out into the yard and so we don't get backlapping compound everywhere. So little quick brag real quick one of the best things uh, the builder of this home did for me was let's see see these these are drains in my garage it's super nice in the winter when we have snow I mean we didn't have snow last year but hopefully this year we'll have some snow so I can water my lawn longer next year but when we do have snow and ice and it gets caked on to the truck or my wife's car, um, when you pull in the garage uh, for the evening or whatever, snow melts off, goes down in the drain, drains out over to here into these rocks. Well, into the ground under the rocks. But uh, yeah, pretty cool. And so it's really nice because I can do things like this. I'm gonna spray off this mower right here in the garage. Pretty nice. So. So we uh, dried her off a little bit, and uh, now we're going to put some grease in the grease zerks, and then uh, she's ready to go, ready to take her out for her uh, maiden voyage with fresh blades. So.
right, guys. That's it. That's it. Hopefully, uh, you learned something. Uh, if you know, if you know more than I do, leave me a comment. Tell me how screwed up I just did. You know, I'd love, I'd love to know. Um. Anyways, that, I mean that that wraps it up for today. You know, kind of short and sweet. Um. You know, it was hard to tell if the back lapping helped a lot. You know, I really, really couldn't tell because I let the grass grow too long. Um, I mowed on Sunday and today's Thursday, so it's been what four days since I mowed, which is a little bit too long in between mowings. Um, so really, the real test is going to be uh, when I mow again Saturday. We'll see how uh, how well it actually does. It seems like it's it's cutting pretty good, but you know, only time will tell. Um, anyways, that's all we got for today. You guys like what I'm doing give me a like a comment and subscribe hit the bell come back for the next episode I appreciate you guys watching and we will see you in the next one